today. I appreciate you having me here. I'd like to thank TEDx as well. Um, first of all, I'd like to say that yes, it is true. I, uh, I made my first documentary whenever I was in fifth grade. And I've been making films ever since. However, uh, back in those days, we shot everything on film. There were video cameras, but they weren't as accessible. And I, if you can imagine filming something and then waiting weeks and weeks and weeks to see it, that's what it was like. And sometimes when you did see it, it was garbage. So nowadays we have an amazing ability, an amazing instant ability to shoot video. And a lot of times, we use cameras like this. This is a camera that I've used at ETV from time to time. But we also use other cameras. We use cameras like this. Some of you, some of you out there probably have cameras like this. How many of you consider yourself filmmakers, want to be filmmakers? I'm sure there's tons of you out there. We also have the ability to make films using our cell phones. People are making films and uploading them to the internet. The internet is the reason why a lot of this has accelerated so much. Because there's an audience now. And there's no reason that everyone out there shouldn't be making films and uploading them to the internet through their phones. Everyone has the ability now to be a filmmaker. Some of us have the ability to use our cell phones correctly. Now some of you are also probably wondering why I have this, uh, this broom with me. And this broom is kind of a symbol to me. Um, I've been at South Carolina Educational Television for uh, almost 18 years now. And I didn't start out just making films while I was there. I started out at a very basic level. And that's called the floor crew. And the floor crew does a lot of things. The floor crew builds sets, the floor crew paints sets, the floor crew runs studio cameras, but they also keep the studios clean. So I became very, 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 very familiar with this tool right here, this piece of technology, this broom. And I became very good at it, as you can tell. So beyond using this broom, I eventually was taught to use a camera, and eventually I learned how to edit, and eventually I uh, started making my own films. Um, some of the places that I've been have been to Europe, to Canada, all over North America, working for, for South Carolina ETV, but while I had all those tools handed to me, taught to me over time, I also had ideas. And those ideas involved technology. And I came up with a, an idea for a television program that involved technology. And it was also an interactive program that, that actually involved the viewer coming up with the ideas for the segments that you see in the show. So to give you a little synopsis, the title of the show is I Wonder. And it, uh, it essentially is a show about a show. It's about a videographer, a camera operator who, who um, has a head injury, which is also autobiographical. And the, uh, the, the videographer um, eventually receives ideas from his audience on where to go and what to see. So I present to you a little synopsis, a little uh, montage, if you will, of, uh, of I Wonder. Thank you very much. 